This is quite the show from the Nurses Union and what you're seeing. This is something that's been going on since 6 a.m. this morning. That is when in sort of a symbolic gesture we saw the night shift end begin to walk out and that's when those who were ready to pick it began to pick it. So this is the beginning of the strike. It is a two day strike. It is happening in the midst of tense negotiations here between the nurses union, the pediatric nurses that work here at Rady Children's Hospital and of course hospital leadership. Now so far uh, what we understand the last offer was from the hospital according to the hospital was about a 25% pay increase over three years as well as a host of other benefits and changes that would go towards the nurses. Now the union leadership brought that to the voting and the, uh, the body uh, of the nurses uh, union but however they went ahead and voted that down. Now we did speak with both sides earlier today that included Katie Langenstrass, a pediatric nurse, but also the head of the local Teamsters uh, Union here that represents these pediatric nurses. Here's what she had to say. The message is the nurses want the hospital to be competitive with the other hospitals in the area. We give very specialized patient care here. We want to stay at Rady's, but in order for us to do that, they need to be competitive in wages and benefits. Now, as I told you, we spoke with both sides. That includes hospital leadership at the very top. Dr. Patrick Frias, the president and CEO of Rady Children's Hospital, who says the hospital has made preparations to account for these nurses being out of out of uh, work here for these next two days. And yes, our nurses nurses right now are, are striking as they have the right to do and we brought in hundreds of skilled nurses from across the country. I spent the weekend meeting them as they were coming and orienting and they're coming from children's hospitals, top children's hospitals and top health systems across the country. I have full confidence that we can provide all the care that's necessary for these children in these next 48 hours. Now what we have heard from both sides is that they will go back to the bargaining table. Again, this strike expected to end Wednesday, 6 a.m. Back to you.